Hej og velkommen til Wine Factory. Jeg er Olivia Biagetti, og jeg er en uh, gæste mellem uh, den her lille vinshow. Og det er min uh, ven og min kammerat, Morten Banner Jørgensen. Skal vi kramme? Jeg har ved Morten for fem år. Kæt på fe- knap. Fem år. fem år siden. Knap fem, fem år. år siden, og ja. jeg er en stor, stor uh, fan, stor fan, fan af Wine Factory. Af mig. Og også Morten. Du er en stor fan af mig. No gang. Skal vi ikke lige fortælle, at uh, Olivia, du, uh, du, du har jo et um, du har et forhold her på bloggen. Ja. Du er, du er, du er, du er, du er, sammen, du er involveret med Mark Gert Rensmann Jens. Yes. Er det ikke rigtigt? Ja. Det er, ja, jeg tror. Jeg tror. Du tror, du tror det. <laughs> du er, jeg du... kan ikke forstå helt, hvad du sagde, Nej, men, men vi, jeg vi, tror, vi, det vi, vi, godt. Altså, så... Olivia, bare lige for lige at køre en lille smule. Olivia her, det er, det er Marks kæreste. Hun er ret så ja. alt er godt. Hun er amerikaner, hun fatter ikke en billede, og når vi snakker dansk og snakker hurtigt, så, så kan vi ikke noget. Så vi, jeg, jeg har bare tænkt mig at snakke i det her til mig hele dagen, og så, ja. så forstår du, hvad jeg siger. Slap dig af. <laughs> we, can, we can change into yeah. English sometimes. It's fine. Yes. Isn't it okay? Yes, yes, yes. We are a bilingual <laughs> show here. Olivia, what the, the, this show is uh, is going to be very interesting because this is the first time you're on the blog. Mm-hmm. You are not like a wine nerd. No. Not a wine geek. No. But you like wine and yeah. you like Mark. Yes. And they go hand We in all hand. like Mark. Sometimes. Sometimes. More than others. <laughs> but... Um, Today yes. we've chosen a bottle here uh, because it's actually uh, it should it is it should actually have been Toby and I or uh, or one of the other guys because Toby maybe Toby actually because Toby is the most in he's probably the, the guy who's most interested in in, in Oloroso Shai yeah. or just Sherry in total. So and what we got here is uh, a very 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 but good thank uh, you for producer. Me. Yes, no, yeah. I, yeah. That and was that is a big shoot to my confidence yes. thing. And that's <laughs> also what I uh, what I what, what we like what we think of you. We have okay. you are all the way up here yeah. in our thoughts. But so, it should uh, have been Toby. Yes, it's, uh, definitely. But but I think you're but much. He's, <laughs> Toby Toby Vasco you, up. You are you are much prettier than Toby. Yeah. So Jack. I think I, th- I think it's uh, it's I think you you re- you yeah. really really earned your spot. Yeah. Okay, Olivia. Okay. Olivia, tell me what is sherry? What does it come from? Which okay. grape do you use? How do you make it? Please tell me because you are the sherry expert. Yes, sherry comes from Spain. Yeah. Where in Spain? Um, Where are we? Outside of Madrid. Outside of Madrid? <laughs> That's pretty wrong, but it's but but it's a good guess. Southern, well, southern Madrid, Spain. Oh yeah, the, southern, it comes from southern Spain. Yes, yes, you're right. And um, the main Sherry, area down there, what's it called? Here is. Yeah, Jerez. but but the, you know, the main big area down there. Andalusia. Andalusia. Yeah, see. Si. Yeah, Andalusia. Si. Uh, Have to put your tongue out. Si. Andalusia yeah. or the sherry or um, it's coming from very. Is it? Uh, it's a lot of oak. Is it old oak? It is old oak. Yeah. Old is oak for from Bordeaux, from no. Burgundy. No, no. I don't actually know. The where oak is burned a bit. Yeah, yeah, a little bit. Yeah. On the in the inside, Probably. it's a bit uh, charred, charred yeah. oak. Probably. In grapes. No. Nah. <laughs> nah. um, yeah, you use grapes, you're right. Yeah, okay, so fully men. But which kind? Which kind of grapes? Yeah, I'm yeah. gonna go with. Uh, Do you think it's on the label? No. I don't think so, actually. To be honest? Hmm. Okay, I'm gonna say maybe. Is it. Pinot Noir? Palomino Fino. Yeah. Pinot Noir? Did you say Pinot Noir? Yeah. That's a great guess. But it's totally wrong. Oh. But it's still a great guess. Okay. Um, pa- Palomino Fino? Palomino Fino? Yeah. And then Pedro Jimenez. Oh, okay. Pedro Jimenez. Okay. Yes. Because Pedro Jimenez can also be a type mm. of sherry. You have different types of sherry. Yes. When you do Oloroso, and but this is an, an Oloroso. Yes. This is dry sherry. Yes. So this is Palomino Fino. Palomino okay. Fino. Okay. Yes. So we have Palo Manafino. What type is Pedro Jimenez? Pedro Jimenez. What do you think? It's very sweet. You're right. Very sweet. Yes. This is much drier. <laughs> You're right. The Kefti Daily. <laughs> Kefti, I mean, Udlings <laughs> Dansk Ord. Yeah. Kefti, have... Kefti er et, er et ord, som Olivia, hun, hun fik en lille smule uh, forkert ind i hovedet. Yeah. Det er egentlig ikke et dansk ord, men vi bruger det. Ja, yeah, vi bruger uh, det. Vi bruger Fordi... det i Wine Factory sammenhæng yeah. en gang imellem. Fordi uh, der er jeg mod Morten. 
han altid siger, hold kæft, hold kæft, det er godt. Hold kæft, det er godt. Hold kæft, det er godt. Og jeg kun har kæft det. Så det er lige en blanding om hold kæft, det Ja, kæft Så du hører det kæft det. Kæft det. Det synes jeg er meget fedt. Kæft det lækkert. Kæft det lækkert, Oliver, hvordan smager det her? Kan du lide det? Ja, ja, ja selvfølgelig det kan jeg godt lide, men... Der står for hvordan man, hvordan det ja, smager. Ja, jeg smager <laughs> karamel. Ja, det er korrekt. Det er korrekt. Super karamel. Ja, sådan fedmefuld. Og... Masser af dybde, intensitet, karamel. Og, ja, og snuffler. <laughs> jeg spiste en snuffel i går. Smager <laughs> helvedes til. Tobias' Olivia, det. yndlingssnack er snuffler. Det er kraftigt lidt, mand. Altså honningkager og snøfler, det er Tobias i nød. Ja, yeah, but a little of that man. old uh, oxidated Nemlig, rum thing. Der er en ting, man skal have på bordet her, når vi lige snakker produktionsmetode også. Det er, at oloroso det er oxideret Ja. Yeah. Du ved, når man har en tynde, ikke? Mm-hmm. så har man et, et, det, den har man ikke fyldt helt op. Ja. Yeah. Så putter man sjære ned i tynden, den, altså, mm-hmm. men man fylder den ikke helt op. Så yeah. dannes der et, et lag yeah. af, af mikroorganismer, yeah. det er sådan set gærceller. Dejligt. De lever af lidt af alkohol, de lever af kvælstof, og de lever lidt ja. af ilt. Yes. Og så danner de et stof, der hedder acetaldehyd. Ja. Acetaldehyd er normalt virkelig dårligt. Mm-hmm. Det er oxideret etanol, alkohol, ja. som er forfærdeligt. Men i, i, altså i alle andre sammenhæng vil det være oxideret vin, det vil være forfærdeligt. Men i Sheres tilfælde, der får du det ned i vin, og der er det godt. Is, er det fordi, det er en høj, højere ja, alkohol? Ja. Nej, nej, nej. Det, det, den, vi er okay. slet ikke derhen okay. endnu. Uh, når man snakker oloroso, Mm-hmm. Det, 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 fordi de her typer, vi har snakket her, hvis man bibeholder det her lag, så mm-hmm. kommer der ikke noget ilt ned. Mm-hmm. Altså gæren lever af ilt, men det er det, mm-hmm. der oppe over vinen. Mm-hmm. Den beskytter ligesom ilten, eller mm-hmm. kæft, den, den beskytter øh, vinen. Mm-hmm. Og så beskytter den, eller den ligger det, og så, og, og så danner den alle de her sjove ting. Hvis man så tilsætter alkohol, mm-hmm. så dør den, fordi at yeah. gærceller kan ikke tåle høj alkohol. Mm-hmm. Er du med? Ja. Yeah. Alle godt. Så dør den, så forsvinder den. Mm-hmm. Bundfældsten. Yes. Og så begynder vi at få ild direkte ned i vinen. Hvad sker der så med vinen, når der, bliver, når der kommer ild til vinen? Hvad sker der så? Så bliver den... Mere akkord. Det er ikke rigtigt. Men, men, men det er fedt gæt Oxidere. igen. Oxidere. Den bliver oxideret. Men ja, hvad, hvad, altså, når, 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 når ting oxiderer, hvad bliver det så? Det er lus og så bliver brun. Det, så bliver det brun, ja. Ja, lus og Farven går for øh, helt hvid, lækker, øh, transparent. <laughs> Gylden, hvidvinsfarvet. Som de typer, som altså, ja, vi kender som Fino eller Mazzanilla, ja. de er sådan vidensfarvet. Øh, men, og det er fordi, de har det der beskyttende lag, men nu begynder man at putte alkohol ned i. Og de ligger for øvrigt også typisk på de der 14-15 procent, 15 mm. måske mere. Ikke? Putter man alkohol ned i, så ender mm. vi på, hvor meget den her på? Den er på 20 procent. 20 procent. Man kan ikke gære en vin til 20 procent, det, det er fysisk umuligt. Ja. Er du med? Yes. Skal vi køre engelsk, eller er det fint nu? Nej, ja, ja, det er umuligt. Nemlig, fordi ja. så dør gærcellerne, før ja. de kan lave 20 procent. Så man tilsætter alkohol, og så dør de der florlag, og så ja. får vi ild ned i, i vin, og så bliver den brun, og så kommer der nogle andre smager. Okay, smager. okay. Fordi hvad smager den af? What does the wine taste of? You can go English if you want to. Okay. Mm. I think it's freakishly good. Uh-huh. This, this, this is a producer called Tradition. This is mm. a normal dry Oloroso from Tradition. Mm-hmm. Um, it's very. I think it's very intense tasting sherry. Yeah. It's very balanced. It's, the acidity is amazing. I was about to say the thing that hits you first is the acidity. Yes. In a good way. Yeah, you're right. And then the nutty, the nutty thing. Yeah. The, um, the vanilla, the 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 the, the, the spicy notes. Mm-hmm. Uh, the the oxidative character it has to be very small. It's very integrated. So it's, I think it's a very, very good. Yeah. What There's a lot of a lot of good that? structure. The acid takes it to a new place because I think mm-hmm. a lot of times when I've had sherry before, it you kind of only just get this oxidated, blah yeah. blah blah blah, and yeah. it's a bit flat. You're right. But You're right. this takes it this to, a, to a new level. To a new level. Yes. Also, a little like chocolatey. Chocolatey. A, Put some a notes ton on of, it. A ton of vanilla. Put some notes. Yes. I think we have a lot of vanilla. Yeah. Put some more notes on it. Um, Olivia, we we, we, we want the camera. The, the guys behind the camera wants to know. What do you think? Well, I think it's quite good. I think you get almonds. I think you get oh, yeah, vanilla. Yeah, you I get think vanilla. actually, yeah. and you know, I'm not a big cigar smoker. No, but 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 it mm. kind of leaves you. The aftertaste is the same way your mouth feels after you have a cigar a little bit, maybe like a little bit of this t- dry but nice taste yeah. in your mouth. It's a long aftertaste. I don't agree, but it's okay. Yeah, it's 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 fine. 
There's no there. But that's where I'm, but maybe it's because I, you're thinking I, it, of warm weather, you're thinking of... I hate when you just smoke a cigar and then, uh, and you, it, I hate it. I hate that feeling you get. Okay. But it's, okay. But, uh, you know, there's a little bit of a tobacco vanilla thingy here. There is. And a little yeah. bit of like... Uh, Do you know how you make sure, by the way? You just told me. No, no, no. It's just a little thing. You know how they like, they, they put uh, barrels on top of each other? Yeah. And then they, when you when you pour a little bit of, of one, one yeah. then you have to take the other one and put down that one, and the oh, one yeah. on top of them, put on, on that one, and then on top of that one, put in that one. So you all the time. It's a chain reaction. Yes, type it is. Of thing? Well, yeah, yes, you can say that. It's like so you always. It, it takes time to start it, of course, mm -hmm. because you need you know a certain amount of vintages. But ah, you have one okay. vin you one vintage here, yeah. one another vintage yeah. on top, another vintage on top, another okay. vintage, on top, and then you like build up in layers. Okay. And then, and then when you say, then when you when you take out from the the, the, the barrel down here, mm -hmm. the most aged one, then you put the same amount uh, from the next uh, barrel down yeah. into that one, and then again the next one down to that one, and then, and then when you when uh, after several years, mm -hmm. then you have one big blend of different vintages. Okay, that's why you do not see you all you like ninety nine percent of the times you do not see a vintage on a share. Yeah. So this one says thirty años. Yes, and that so is thirty. The oldest. Sherry in here is 30 years. Yes. But it was bottled in 2015. Yes. Oh. You're right. Okay. Yeah, I guess that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That's what a little that? bit. That's a little bit. That's not. I think that's no, 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 that the, the, number no, no, 172. Is, yeah. yeah. Okay, we don't know when it was bottled, but. No, nobody says that. But yeah. Okay, but 30 years. Yes. 30 years old Sherry, and that is the oldest blend. You're right. Okay. Yeah. No, or, man, or it's. Is it the youngest? I think he's the oldest. I'm actually not sure. Sometimes, you know. Sometimes the teacher... <laughs> Fucks up. Yeah, but that's, that's, that's part awesome. of good teaching. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Olivia, how many points do you want to give this one? Well, <laughs> it is the second best sherry I've ever had. Which one was the best? Uh, I had a really good sherry in Madrid at this wine bar with Ooh. a black cat. With a black where cat Where you on couldn't it. take any pictures. Are you sure? Absolutely. Why, why couldn't you take any pictures? Protocol. Protocol. Respect. Respect, respect of respect. the bottle. It was absolutely fantastic. It came straight out of the you wooden drunk. barrels. You were drunk. You were drunk I say. wasn't drunk, but you were drunk. but probably the atmosphere. No, this is a bad atmosphere, but second best sherry I ever had. I okay. would say I'm going Tre Ahafems. Tre Ahafems. Yeah. Tre Ahafems. Bamadai Morden. Men det er kæftig lækkert. Kæftig lækkert. Det er. Kæftig lækkert. En super satisfying. Jeg vil, jeg vil... Det er meget tilfælde. <laughs> Men hvad med... Sorry, Morten. Jeg, jeg forstyrrer dig. Det plejer altid, plejer altid at være mig, der ligesom holder de andre for at snakke det om. Men nu her, det synes jeg er fantastisk. Uh, I think I'm gonna go... I think I'm gonna go... Um, in a sherry context, I'm gonna go 95, 96 wow, in this one. Wow, okay. But in a like all around wine context, I'm mm -hmm. gonna go uh, 93 on this one. Okay. So, try your herbs. Perfect. Oh, yes. that was not, let's do one more. I, I, actually, maybe maybe nine maybe ninety four. Okay. I think nine 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 three nine. Yeah. nine I, I think no no. I'm gonna keep it on ninety three. But okay. it's like Toby would Super definitely. Super good. Yes. Very uh, <laughs> good. On the Ken Gottlieb Sherry. So do get put in here. Yeah. Here's it. And I'm gonna say one more thing. Do get us for us put wine factory, put Instagram. This yeah here's it. <laughs> Olivia Olivia has a thing with pictures. So, well, yeah, that was that was amazing to uh, have you on the blog. Um, Thank you. Mm -hmm. Adverso flint. I, I, th I think uh, people will uh, enjoy this uh, uh, this uh, um, this episode actually. The whole way I, I, I definitely I learned a lot. Yeah. So that's good. Yeah, and you guessed a lot. That's perfect. Oh. I think it's good. Yeah. Cheers. Cheers. Hi hi. <laughs>